Alright, everyone was back up and everyone is uh, restored. I am I'm looking at you, uh, Rasad. Where's Ready the loot? Mine. Oh, there it is. Whew. I thought I lost it for a second there. Well, let's check this alcove first. <laughs> what? I checked it for traps. You bastard. Dodge them. Dodge them all. Tahassar's heart and another scepter gem. Give me some I have two down. out of three gems and I don't actually think I need to keep these hearts. Because they are probably um, uh, like a quest item for the other faction, I think. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. I'm waiting. But either way, we are going to continue on. Because this is the I'm only waiting. way to go from this um, room. Let's just double check. Continue from there as I began. Uh, he bids himself to journey onward. Let's do that. And that brought me to one of the rooms I've cleared before. If it must be done. And next up, where will do we go? South until the obelisk I found. Find. So keep going south until I reach that obelisk about the uh, imprisoned one. Stuff it's again. Probably best left this is where I fought the tieflings. I'm not sure if that's gonna make it on the video, but I'm assuming it will. Keep going south, and it's this is the obelisk. All right, we're on track. Uh, setting sun. That's west, and then I have to go north. And then north. Hey, not a concern. A new room this is worth it. with a what was that? It can be on. Haven't seen those in a while. He's standing right here. I can't move where I want to. Oh come on! Oh, he summoned more demon knights. Holy shit! Holy shit! Holy shit! Um. Take one of these big potions, Nera. That'll help you a lot. Look at that. It healed her fully. Taste my foot. Taste my foot. Take them down. At your own prerogative. Yeah. <laughs> now, where do I go next? Setting sun, north. And then... North. Alright, so this should be only be north left, but before that I wanna um, restore Minsk and level up Nira and Rasad. Let's see, skip, uh, skill points, hit points, put that in, move silently. And I should be able to get Whirlwind Attack now. Awesome! On uh, my friend Rasad. Whirlwind Attack. That should be pretty damn powerful. Nira, level 8 spell. And I'll take a comment on you. And we'll learn another simulacrum. And I'll leave this for now. Give me some direction. And then we'll rest and then we'll move on north. Last room, if I've understood things correctly. Uh oh, there's a demon wraith over here. And he summoned some slave wraiths. You, you and you, try to work on this guy. Um, I just walked into a death trap, I think. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's try that again. Everyone stop, turn off AI. Uh, you guys you just stay where you are. Jacques. Does Bless give any uh, bonus to saving throws? I think it does. Morale and attack and damage. Crap, that's not what I wanted. How about chant? 
Yes, that gives uh, saving throws, but I mm. don't I already have that. I do. What else you got? Offensive harmony probably helps a bit. Mm. Either way, you will want to start off with a fireball right over there. Give me some also direction. you, why not? You will want to do a simulacrum. That should help a bit. Well, I interrupted my own spell. Now you! Find the spells, find the traps, find all of the traps. Get it? He didn't do a time stop this time. Or maybe that's what he's casting right now. It probably is. No? It, it wasn't! Ready for anything. Uh, you exact got confused. Take down these guys. My resist fear works wonders. I'm happy about that. Now you get over here and start hitting this guy. Yes, I interrupted him, I think. No, I didn't. But I did do a lot of damage on him. I think he's casting a um, Whale of the Banshee. Move away. I said move away. He's casting something. Very bad. And he did a mislead. You guys take down these wraiths already. You're not doing very well this episode. Give me some direction. Come on. Yeah. There he goes. I punch. Jump on my sword. Now you, you do a fine trap. That should help. Just so I know where they are, but I can't what can I do? Uh, dispel them or disarm them. Follow your strength. There's one. What else can we find? I'm waiting. He's back. Oh, there's a trap right next to cart. Luckily, I didn't trigger that just yet. Do a breach. Do a breach. Oh, he's invisible. Nira, do a gem choosing. Illusion dispelled. Cards, breach it. And then we should get him down. Awesome. Now, Cart, do not move. I don't want to risk uh, you uh, triggering that trap. Dispel Hexat. What would you have? You are lucky I'm here. But we have a lot of loot to deal with here. If that is what you want. And then we're gonna head. I think this is the next level or something. Yeah, that's probably what it is. So that is what we're gonna do next up. Let's see what we got. We got a rose stone. We got some healing potions. Ooh, a white dragon scale. On your behalf. Screw that spear. I don't want it. I do want this very much so. A journal. I do want the journal. The booklet is an extremely old and tattered journal of an adventurer by the name of Sir Calthorine Utwistan. The pages are yellowed with age and have been damaged by taloned feet walking over them, but various pieces are still readable. Sir, Sir Calthorine comments more specifically on the dangers of finding his way past the demons and devils of this level of the keep, noting especially the dead magic zones in the blue rooms and the wild magic zones in the red rooms and that he had almost reassembled the needed Scepter of Radiance. One comment Sir Calfrain makes is on the portals themselves. He thought the fact that you could re-enter a portal you just emerged from and not come out in the room it led to from to be interesting. interesting, and considered the possibility that such a fact might be important in fighting one's way through the maze. Beyond this, the only lengthy part seems to be Sir Calfrain's utter disgust at the betrayal of the Knights of the Vigil for his predicament. Nothing more detailed can be found about this, and it seems especially odd as the journal appears to be perhaps half a century old or more. Huh, so are the um, order up to no good? I'll have to remember that, but I'll also want to um, 
get a bit of progress done. So let's keep going. Yeah. According to the book, I should be heading north once again. And I made it out! Why, hello there. A prime, is it? I thought we'd been drawn into the prime material plane, but I couldn't be sure with all this interference. Pardon my atrocious manners. I sometimes forget that you primes are civilized. My name is Ayers Gareth, and these are my servants and pets. And just what manner of creature are you? Well, how rude. If you must know, I am a Cambion of a noble house from a place called Cursed. Any other questions? Perhaps. I'm Cart, by the way. Well now, nice to meet someone pleasant instead of a host of frustrated fiends. Had to destroy several after we found ourselves here, the rude beasts. But what does one expect from the lower plains, eh? Me, I'll take sigil any day and avoid the blood war entirely. But that's neither here nor there. We found ourselves in this place after being drawn somehow. I imagine the magic of the broken portal on the east side of this ca cavern has something to do with it. Wherever this place is, it allows me to gate in things. Minor things. But not to open a gate back out. Interesting, no? I could gate out of this place, but the magic here is very powerful and specific. Likely I need some manner of key to pierce the shields of this place. Do you know such a thing? Hmm... I believe I do. I can arrange for your exit if you wish. No, I could let you out for a price. I have no wish to purchase my way out of here at any price. That is so boring. Tell you what. I'll play you for it. Allow me to explain. I have a certain, certain penchant for games of chance. I enjoy all kinds of gambling, but today I have something with me of particular interest. You see, I just finished winning a deck of many things from a relative of mine, Duke Rowan. It's a beautiful deck, a variation of the norm by a Genasi wizard of some repute. So who wants to play a game? Minsk and Boo are fond of all sorts of games, although Boo is far better at the ones that need strategy. I'm sad to say that I'm far better better at straightforward butt kicking. I'm eager to try it. I'll play you for the item that exits this place, or other things if you have something of value. What do you say, Cart? Pique your interest at all? I might be, I have to think about it. Well, here's something to entice you. I have a gem. I believe its magic has something to do with the broken portal behind me. I'll wager it for the way out of this place. But you'll probably wish to prepare yourself and so forth. Take as much time as you need. It is a deck of many things after all, and not for the faint of heart. If you or some companion of yours is ready to play, come and speak to me. Unless of course you're too frightened. 